Let's take a look at what's coming to your big screens as well as your small screens this May. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Matt's Monthly Movies. Anna Faris stars in Overboard. Based on the 80s movie of the same name, Faris is a working class single mother hired to clean a rich yet terribly rude playboy's yacht who suffers a serious injury after falling overboard and loses his memory. Faris takes advantage of the situation and convinces him that they're married and puts him to work. Deadpool 2. Deadpool is back for round two to break some bones and some fourth walls, but he meets his match in the villain Cable, played by Josh Brolin, who also played Thanos in Infinity War, making that two villains that Josh Brolin plays in the MCU. The first Deadpool was an instant hit, and this one's shaping up to be even bigger. It's a great time to be a Marvel fan. Life of the Party. Melissa McCarthy returns to college after being dumped by her husband. McCarthy navigates the full college experience much to her daughter's disgust, but finds her true self somewhere along the way. Terminal. Stars Margot Robbie, Simon Pegg and Mike Myers who find themselves in an unknown sprawling city. Two assassins trying to complete their mission, a troubled school teacher on the verge of a fatal illness, a suspicious waitress who isn't what she seems and a lonely janitor all tied up in this noir thriller. Solo, a Star Wars story. 40 years after we first met the scruffy looking nerf herder, we are finally learning his origin story. Alongside Amelia Clarke from Game of Thrones, Woody Harrelson and Donald Glover, this movie is set to be one of 2018's biggest movies, even with the countless issues and reshoots during production. Now I think it's safe to say it can't possibly be as controversial as The Last Jedi, but Disney did well with the previous Star Wars story, Rogue One, so I guess we'll see. Moving over to our smaller screens, Netflix has been absolutely killing it in the sci-fi department lately, bringing out another cyberpunk movie called Anon. In a world where everyone's information is free game, a detective tracks an assassin who has been deleted from all records. A little help has comedy icon Carol Burnett returning to our TVs with some clever kids by her side to help solve some adult problems with the brutal honesty that these kids bring to the table. The Rain is a new series taking place after a fatal virus has taken over Scandinavia. Two siblings band together with other survivors to find the truth about what happened to the world that's falling apart around them. But what are you most looking forward to this May? Let me know in the comments below. But until next time, this is Matt Rogers, and that is all.